deep in bear country. Lives a Bernstein bear family. <laughs> They're kind of furry around the torso. They're a lot like people, only more so. Bernstein Bears When things go wrong as things might do The Bernstein Bears will find a way through Mama, Papa, Sister and Brother They'll always be there for each other Bernstein Bears The Bernstein Bears Some dreams make cubs laugh Some dreams make cubs cry It's interesting to think about what they dream and why Okay First we watch Space Grizzlies and then we play How about who knows what? We haven't played that in a long time. That sounds good to me. Now, the big question is, who gets to pick this week's family night snack? Um, the schedule says... It's Mama's turn. Hmm, now what shall we make? How about, um, honey squares? Would that have anything to do with honey squares being your favorite? Well, <laughs> maybe just a little bit. How about peanut butter and banana roll-ups? We haven't had those in a while. No, not since the last time you got to pick the weekly snack. <laughs> what do you think, sister? Um, celery sticks with, with cheese. cheese. <laughs> <laughs> okay then, I think I'm going to choose some of everything. Yay! <laughs> Do you think we have time to make everything? If we hurry, it's almost time for Space Grizzlies! Grizzlies! Okay, Papa. Here comes the fleet. <laughs> Don't forget the honey squares. <laughs> Space Grizzly! The continuing adventures of Major Ursa! Yay, Ursa! Ursa! And Princess Gemma! Yay, Gemma! In this week's episode, our brave space heroes defend the universe against a new intergalactic bad guy, Sleezo, mastermind of space! <laughs> Ooh, he sure looks scary. Yeah, keep him away from me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where does he get that laugh? <laughs> Will Major 
Tarzan and Princess Gemma escape the clutches of Sleezo, mastermind of space? <laughs> Join us next week for another thrilling adventure of Space Grizzlies! Wow, I can't wait to see how next week's episode turns out. Great show, huh, sis? It was okay. Let's play Who Knows What. That looks really good, sister. It's Princess Gemma. It was Brother's idea to make space grizzlies. Look at mine, Mama. <gasps> Sleezo? But I thought you were making Major Ursa. But Sleezo's cool. Okay, time to clear your stuff away. I have to set the table for dinner. Okay, Mama. Hey, sis, do you want to play space grizzlies after supper? I don't think so. I wonder whose turn it is to pick this week's family night snack? That's right! Tonight's a new episode of... <sighs> Space Grizzlies! <laughs> well, look at that. <laughs> it's my turn. That means honey squares. You know the rules. Our homework's all done. I just have a little spelling left to do. Well, you have a little time before dinner. Come on. I'll quiz you. I forgot it's Space Grizzlies night. Do you have too much homework to do? No, I finished mine already. Is something wrong, sister? No. The TV's all set. Are the honey squares ready? Almost. <laughs> Although it looks like all this honey has got sister stuck on slow motion. Come on, sis. Hurry, it's about to start. Okay, sister. You do the honors. <laughs> no, little lady. <laughs> Cut it out. <laughs> little lady, I said... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to make some more. Hurry, you're going to miss the beginning of the show. I think she might need some help. So, you thought you could outsmart the mastermind of space, Major Ursa? <laughs> I thought you could use some help. I can do it, Mama. You go back and watch the show. But I'd like to help. That way you won't miss so much of the show. I don't mind missing it. <laughs> You're not too fond of Sleezo, are you? He... he kind of scares me. Well, the important thing to remember is that when you're afraid of something, it always helps to talk about it. Sometimes that makes it not so scary. I've been having bad dreams about Sleezo, Mama. In one of my dreams, he came right out of the television, laughing that scary laugh. Sleezo is a made-up character. He's just pretend like someone dressed up in a costume for Halloween. But that doesn't mean he still can't be pretty scary. And no matter what it is, if anything on television frightens you, you don't have to watch it. I don't? No, you don't. Then I think I'd like to go up to my room and do some coloring. Okay, then. We'll see you later. Thanks, Mama. Talking about it does make me feel better. Uh-oh. What are we going to do with all those honey squares? <laughs> oh, I think Papa might have the answer to that. <laughs> You're just pretend. And I'm not going to let you give me any more bad dreams, Sleezo. Say, Sleezo, do you know why the pony couldn't sing? No, sister. I don't know. Why couldn't the pony sing? <laughs> because he was a little horse. <laughs> Get it? Horse? <laughs>
What do you say to that, tough guy? Pretty funny, huh? <laughs> now your sleeves are the softiest face. Was it about Sleezo? No, why do you think that? Because I was having bad dreams about Sleezo. Mama told me when you're afraid of something, it's always good to talk about it. That made him not so scary. You were having bad dreams about Sleezo? Mm-hmm. Okay, I have been too. This time, it was a whole bunch of Sleezos chasing me. Then I got stuck and there was this big banana roll up rolling toward me. Whew. Pretty scary. Well, maybe it wasn't so scary. Now that I told you about it, it it's kind of silly, really. See? Talking about it does help. And you know what else? If I see something on the TV I don't like, I'm just not going to watch it anymore. That sounds like a good idea, sis. <sighs> so does not eating so many honey squares so late at night. I had another good idea, too. Huh? <laughs> Not so scary anymore, is he? Now he looks like a nice guy. Silly, but still a nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> You know, Wedding Barry would never marry anyone who's scary. That's why Sleezo has now become Fleezo Nice Guy of Space! Let the biggest wedding in the universe begin! Dum dum da dum! Dum dum da dum! 